Magic Mixy Hokey Pokey, give me a loverly. Oh. Oh. Welcome to Adventure Fun. <laughs> Okay guys, Magic Mixies has a new set of cauldrons out. We did the uh, first set of cauldrons. Well, this is series two, and in series two, you got two colors. You have the blue and you have the pink. The reason why we got two blues and two pinks is because in the pink, there's two different plushies you can get in the color pink. And then blue, there's two different plushies you can get in the color blue. And so we're hoping that we nailed it. If not, well, you get the idea, right? Well, here, let's give you more of an idea. You can see it says Magic Mixies, and it's the Magical Gem Surprise. Then below that says Magic Mixie Plushie. That's what you want to get out of here. And it's got the Fizz Potion Gem Reveal. So you're going to do some fizzing, which sounds really fun and cool. And then let's see, over to the left, it says, oh, collect them all. So the Water Magic is for the blue, and the pink, if we look on the blue, we'll say they're Fire Magic. Oh, there you go. <laughs> pink. That looks pink to me. It's a lighter red is what it is. And you can see with the Water Magic, one of the Mixies in blue has the blue mane around her face, and the other one's got a red mane. And this one, the blue, the top one actually looks like it's got four arms because it doesn't look like wings. Okay, so we got Mixies. All right, man. See, you messed up the potion and look what happened. They got four arms instead of two. <laughs> okay, I don't know. And then over here, you got six magical steps. And so this is the fire magic and who you magically create. And then on the back, it's got six magical steps. And one, you pour the powder on top. And then two, you write something down on a parchment that says you're going to name your Mixie. Then three, you're going to put water on it and it fizzes. Then four, you get this gem that pops out. And five, you got your magical mixie the fire one you better wear oven mitts because it's hot and then number six oh, it looks like you get a ring somebody's got their hand there and they got something on their finger it's fire that's cool i guess all we need to do now is just open up the fire mixie on the back you can see that you've got a uh, little arrow that says hey perforation go ahead and tear here may mm -hmm. the fire could be with you oh, well you got to take the top off too i assume right because that's bound up because look, if the top off, that's all you're doing is going inside. Why do we want to take this off? I mean, I like it. Can we just leave it on? So let's see if we can leave it on because it says, you know, you can tear this off. I mean, it's beautiful packaging, right? So we pop the top and be like, oh, look at that. Oh, we got a yellow uh, little pipette. <laughs> That's what you do with the pipe, 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 pipe. right? Peter Piper, pipe, pipe, pickle. And it's a cool looking pipette. It's a big one, man, for the water. Cool. And there's the parchment right there. Because that's what they did in the series one. You can go ahead and write the name of your mixie on there. Ooh, look at the fire powder. In fuego. That looks cool. And then it says, stop. Just to stop, read this first. This spell involves water and fizz. For those of you who are like got waphobia, fear of water, you want to make sure somebody else does it for you. So we're going to pull this out. So when you pull the instruction manual out, look at that. Okay, so it says, add the bubble and fizz dust. Do not remove, because you know, that's where the magic's at, okay? But to get the full details, there you go. You open this up, there's the front, the back, the back of the front. What? On here, it says right here, guys, there's a total of six plushies to collect. I thought there was just four. We missing something? That's weird, because they don't show it on the outside. They just show two for the water and then two for the fire. They don't show an extra one. If you look at the water one, the water has a mermaid tail, and that's the first plushie for the water one. And the second water one, actually it's got like extra arms or I don't know maybe they're weird looking wings and then the third one actually looks like it's another mermaid but with kind of like oh maybe it's a snake I don't know but it's got this little rattler on the back and then for the fire mix is one we're looking at so we either get the first one that uh, has no wings and just a tail and the second one that actually has like a dragon fire wings and fuego and then the third one I don't know it's got kind of a little pushy end or something I can't tell they don't let you know oh man that's what they do they get you so they'll buy more so you can get the ultra rares. Well, we may do it. <laughs> so be sure to like and subscribe in case we get the extra ones so we can show you what it looks like. Um, the fun continues. Use the gem case to store your elemental mixy plushie or your own personal uh, treasures. Okay, now that we know that, we'll just flip it over. It's got the magic steps here. So first we need to sprinkle the bubble fizz dust onto the cauldron. Warning, do not remove the paper to the cauldron because if you do, the warning is you're going to let loose uh, Pandora's box. You know, you got to do it right. You know, you got to do your hocus pocus right. So, woo, James Brown, he don't go with that. Hey, he's hot. It is gonna be hot. Don't we love it? Oh, we pour that on there. Okay, well, I wonder if it's gonna change color when we add water to it. Okay, so I guess we just kind of sprinkle it around. It burns, it burns. Uh, it is powdery though. So, you know, we gotta sprinkle the dust around. That's what we do. Oh, don't breathe it in. Air filter, air filter. filter. And then we gotta write our magic mixy name. Whew, yeah, it does get in the air, so don't breathe that in, guys. There's our scroll. Take that off. Here's the parchment. It's very fragile. It can tear easily. Uh, do we have like, let me do this one, this one, green. What's your magic mixing name be, Lovey? Oh, let's put it Lovey. <laughs>
I got it right here. Reminds me when I was in the show. My fair lady, isn't it lovely? Lovely, that's the name. So we'll put that right there. Oh, she's so lovely, huh? Oh, now we gotta get some water. Doesn't come with water. So disappointed. Why would you put water on fire? Because they don't want you to have a match. That'd be cool if you lit it. <laughs> hey, how about you? Let's cook some stuff. Woo! We're using our typical glass here, just one bite. It's cool, you know, just uh, the poison apple here. So let me go ahead and suck it up. And then does it change color? Oh, look at that. Magic mixy hokey pokey. Give me a loverly right now, okie dokie. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> can we hear it? I can hear it. Ooh, it's starting to, look, look, it's pulling up. Or it's exploding, it's coming up. Oh, look at that. It's, oh, it looks like it's coming. Oh! <laughs> That's what it warned you for. That's papers holding it down. And it's like, pop goes the weasel. <laughs> it's like, oh, okay. That's totally cool. What a mess. Maybe we ought to use more water. Here at Adventure Fun, we take our magic mixies seriously. So let's go ahead and pull the ooze out. It's protected in its... Yeah, look at... Yeah, look inside. It's just a little... Some sort of spring. It's pressurized. Once it's popped up, I don't think there's anything you can do now. So next, say the magic words. Oh, we forgot to say it. I just start going, I don't know. One of the words I said actually triggered it, so we're good. <laughs> oh, you turn it upside down, there it is. Okay, we're pulling it out. Who do we get? Do we get an ultra? Oh, look, and you got the ring too. Darling, look at that. Oh, it's the fire ring. Okay, you can't look at it yet. We'll put it behind you because you got to focus on the fire ring. It won't fit on me, but you see that? Oh, splash ice cold water on your magic ring to activate the color change. Wow. Okay, so for the water, it turns blue. Expose your magic fire ring to the light for 30 seconds to activate its glow in the dark powers. This one glows in the, the dark. dark. Well, we'll have to do that in just a minute. And who do we get? I gotta flip this over now. This is so exciting. We get an ultra rare. Oh, we got Batty Coda. Anybody watch Fur and Gully? I keep using that reference, but it's so cool. Look at Batty. We got the bat one. I'm Batman. No, it just doesn't sound good. It, it's a gal. It's a Batty girl. I'm Batty for you. Would you like to get us on Valentine's Day? Hey, you know, it's pink. It works, right? Love. I love you. That's why I called her Lovely. <laughs> Oh, did you see that? That gem? Hold on, let me, let me take a look. When you twist it, you move it side to side, it actually looks like the flames are dancing. Dance with me. Everybody dance with me. That's cool, man. They kicked this one up. These uh, Series 2 Magic Mixies are super cool. I love my little Batty coat. If I wouldn't have known it would have been Batty, I would have called her Batina. But no, we had to go with Lovely, and she's happy with it. Now, can she stand if I just adjust her? Yes! That's cool. Now we have to open up the second one, but let's open up the blue one. They'll just rip through the other ones in just a minute, but I assume the ring's gonna be the same. We gotta put this over here, and guys, stay till the end because, you know, we gotta do the glow in the dark to see how well it glows. Uh, yeah, just the top. Hey! Well, yellow can go with fire, but that looks more like it matches. Nah, I'm just saying. Okay, don't remove, man. You start cutting this and boom, it's gonna pop out. Should we just visit? This time, we're going all out at Adventure Fun Guys. Adventure Fun Guys. Are you an Adventure Fun Guy or Adventure Fun Girl? Are you a fun G? <laughs> Please know us in the comment. Comments, because we hope there's more than one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, move around. Oh, look, we're creating our own little feng shui garden. Doo, 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 doo. Look at I just raked it just right. It's like golfing. Four. Okay, where's our thing? We gotta write something here. There it is, right there. And then we pull it out because the back, then you can see it's blue. Okay. Okay, give it a name, camera mom. I think blue is for boys. Can we do something else <laughs> instead of cutie? How about pirate booty? <laughs> <laughs> and we, you know, it's got to be because it's got to be a, a, just not a first name, last name. I mean, his last name is, you know, Booty, Pirate Booty. We just say Prudy. But, you know, it's water. So what's a water name? Waterloo, finally facing my water. Wah, 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 wah. Finally faced my Waterloo. Abba? Oh, gosh. You grew up in the long time ago. I just kind of burned 20 years ago. So here we go, guys. <laughs> We're going to visit. We're going all out. Oh, that just pops out so clean. Look at that. Oh, Alka Seltzer pop, pop, fizz, fizz. Oh, so all the water just slides down to the side, right? Oh, you know what? This one actually has a bottom. The other one had a bottom that didn't come off. Oh, see that? Oh, and you can look inside. That's where you can store things, right? So you can now store things in there, but you got no top. Hey, maybe it does double as a Halloween thing, you know? Hey. Yeah, still fizzing. Okay, here we go, guys. Who do we get for the blue? Do we get the one with the tail, a mermaid tail? Oh, I think we did. Okay, well, you have to start with some... Oh, see, there you go. The color changing. Ice wire is going to change blue. And here's our merman, the dude, Waterloo. Oh, let me take a look at the gem on the on his forehead. It's kind of like... Ugh. 
I'm getting seasick. I'm getting noxious. <laughs> Look at that water just move around on the head there. It's cool. You can move the camera around just side to side. You might be able to pick it up better than me, just like kind of moving it around. But that's cool. Oh man, remember how you used to rub the hair in one of the magic things and it was like it would change colors and stuff? It's like, I don't know. Junior, you put your pants on both legs in a <laughs> leg hole. <laughs> now, how do you get. Ooh, maybe he'll sit. You don't want him to lean over like that because that would be bad on the back. Uh, lean against your Easter. There we go. Okay, now we gotta find out if we got different ones. And you know, you can look at the codes at the bottom if they have any codes, I don't know. Oh, WB10423. This is a WB10423. Ah, <laughs> oh, they're all the same. Oh no. This one's WB10423. Ah, we're not gonna find out unless we actually open this up, guys. Well, we're gonna do this, because Adventure Fun, we like to get into things and know what the secrets are. No, we're just gonna... This is what not, you're not supposed to do. Ah! <laughs> Ooh, who we get this time? Oh, see, he got four arms, he got four... Oh, wow, that feels really good. Look at the water waves on that. Look at that, look at that, that looks cool. What is that? Water waves. It's a tattoo camera, Mom, but he's got four arms. All the more to hug you with. And the strands of hair actually kind of like silver lining. You're getting old. <laughs> This is just cool. Just the back, just the water like waves in here. It just looks cool. And then you can see the water wave gem here, just kind of going around. That's cool. And then the tail tucked between the legs, running away. We didn't name him, so we'll just call him Gooseberry because it looks like, like a gooseberry. That looks cool. I'm glad we got different ones, guys. This is super awesome. Okay, so we got two rings and they're both gonna turn, you know, when we get ice water here. Last one, so I assume this last one, we're gonna get the first one in the picture here. It looks like kind of a dragon's tail, but God, I'd really like to get one of these question marks. Look, even Moose is not sure what they got. It's a surprise. You know what? Maybe the codes are gonna be different on the ultra rares. Guys, put in the comments if you got one of these. You better let us know, we'd love to know. Oh, there we go. Okay, what do we get? Here we get. Yeah, I assume it's just... Yeah, it looks like the first picture. You know, we lucked out because we could have gotten the same ones. Because the codes, you can't tell. Well, the color the color eyes are all the same. Wait a second. Oh, look at their eyes, guys. Okay, so this one's a dark pink and that one's a lighter pink. Kind of orange or something. Oh, man. And then these blues right here. So eyes of the winter to the soul. Or the cauldron. And now you know, you got a dark blue over here, light blue over there, okay? Wow, I lucked out. I wasn't looking at the eyes when I bought them. I was just focused on the color of the cauldron is like okay there's blue and there's this uh pink ish red <laughs> i mean look at the tail here so guys look at that this one's a cool looking one i don't know salamander maybe we ought to call him seller so how do you get him to stand oh maybe move it back they did good on this because i bet you can get him to stand Wow, that's cool, guys. And these mystery ones, now I'm really curious because the other one looks like it's kind of got like fins for the um, blue. And the other one looks more like a lion kind of laying down. I guess I'll have to pay attention to those eyes, guys. Uh, but let's go ahead and get the, see what it looks like in the dark, the glow rings and also the cold water. I don't think this is cold enough. Okay, guys, I think what threw me off is that in the first series, all the columns were the same. So I just bought a bunch of them, and didn't look at the eyes. And the, nobody told me that the eyes were all different. So then we finally caught on to the eyes were different. So we were able to collect them all this one is that they just have different eyes here but if you look on the uh, page here they show you the different color eyes but you wouldn't know that until you opened up the booklet here so you can see the top two have different color eyes first one's a blue green the second one's a blue for the water then the last one doesn't show you the eye so we don't know if there's like another out there that has like a yellow eye or it's just mixed in like with the blue or the blue green and you just happen to go huh i got something weird and it's not this one that has the blue eye i, I just don't know and then the the bottom Bottom one for the fire you got like a, an orangey then it goes to a pink and then again question mark it doesn't tell you what the eyes are guys if you notice anything about it please let us know and then if we find anything we'll put it in the comment we'll pin it up at the top and go hey you look for these eyes all right and so let's go ahead and take there's our fire for the glow in the dark here's the water and if we put it in cold Oh yeah, look at that. So you know what that means? Uh, if you want it blue, you gotta keep your fingers cold. Look at that, it shows you, you know, that if you're cold hearted, <laughs> it's like, I'm so cold, warm me up. And it starts to warm up pretty fast, so it starts you know, changing back. So the only way to keep it that way, 
Yeah, she, you know, December is gonna look popping and kicking. <laughs> That's really dark. I look at that. Oh my gosh, the moment I touch it, I'm a warm blooded mammal. That's cool. Ah, I love it. Okay, now let's go ahead and do the glow in the jar. First in the black light, guys, when you look at the Magic Mixies plushies here, they all kind of blend pretty well, but look at Batty, Batella. Oh, it's the Batty. Those wings are just popping, man. Black light, fantastic show. Okay, here, we got the glow in the dark ring. And we're using black light because it charges out faster. Three, two, one. I'm not sure how it's picking up on the camera, but it looks like it's glowing pretty well. Okay, guys, which one's your favorite? Do you like the cool blue or do you like the fiery red pink? I think my favorite out of all this is the baddie. That looks awesome, guys. Be sure to like and subscribe because we got more on the way. Now onto the Fortnite challenge. We're not gonna win in a Magic Mixies plush skin and she's got those plush uh, things on her head. I, I don't know of any Magic Mixies, but she actually does come with some magic here, or at least for an emo. So let's go. Uh, guys, I just came in at the last second, but I'm going to see what happens. We're going to go ahead and continue with the game. Um, and I'm just going to land over here, um, just on the outskirts of the island, campfire place. And, hey, the glider's magical mixy thingy, right? <laughs> the skin. I just love her puffy hat ears. Kind of reminds me of Guff or Puff, the big fat Fortnite puff stuffed animal, whatever. I try to keep the skins different. Otherwise, I would have done him again. So hopefully this skin will do it for us and we'll get a win. And I love her pickaxe. I felt it, that it went well with her. Um, good, we got some slaps. You know what? I think I'm just gonna go ahead and buy a thermal scope. And then take another mini. Her skin is kind of like Christmassy. I mean, with that little ball in the back of her head, it kind of reminds me of a Santa hat. Okay, good. Shockwaves, nice. And shells. And a chest. What do we have here? Ah, potty break, good. Or a cauldron, that's right. We don't call these uh, big pots for our Magic Mixie challenges. They're cauldrons. Ah, just filled up on a cauldron, but there's no magic mixing inside. Magic is now in me. I have full shield. Yay! <laughs> ooh, 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 rare chest. Um, at least I can get an upgrade there with a suppressed rifle. Oh, there's somebody here. Oh, he sees me. Oh, I'll go upstairs. Bye bye. Yeah, I think he's in the hunt for me. He doesn't dare search the El Bano. You know what? I don't have to be trapped. Let's shockwave out of here. Bye-bye. Woo! Oh, I guess he came in here and did some good work. I would like the grappling gloves since I don't have many shockwaves. Ooh, yeah. Oh, oh. Bye-bye. Ah, oh, hitting a tree. Okay, let's grapple now. Yeah. Ooh. I don't know where he went. I totally left a mark in the roof there. My gold chest is still there. Let's just go ahead and cut open the ceiling here. Mm, didn't fall down, did it? Ooh, ooh. Oh, wow. All this for one chest? It better be something good, man. Magic Mexicus. Oh, okay, not bad. Flapjack rifle, I'll take. I wasn't prepared for it, otherwise you use, I would have used my most powerful Magic mix spell for a gold legendary flapjack. Whee! This is so fun, the grappling glove. And it really moves around. That's so cool. <laughs> we got another chest here, yay! Oh, we got a demon llama. Llama llama ding 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 dong. <laughs> These sound like sick llamas, like they need some sort of like a cough syrup. <laughs> okay, let's go. And I can still hear that sick llama. Man, somebody give him a cough drop. <laughs> Jeez. Oh man, I wonder what the new update's gonna be like, season four. Make it a Marvel collab, make it a Marvel collab. God, it's really been quiet over my neck of the woods, except for that one dude. There's nobody else. It's like a ghost town, Scoop. <laughs> right, Raggy? 
Ooh, that's a lot of goodies down there. Let's go. And that's not a real bush, folks. Doesn't look like it belongs there. Okay, Blue Havoc. Oh, repeater rifle. Mm. Forthog, shrub, mud. Oh, there he is, this pink panda girl. I was thinking about being that skin, but I was once before for a Max Up Mixie plus challenge. And that's why I didn't want to do it, because you get picked off that fast. <laughs> Big pink skin. Oh, hello. I'm wearing a red skin with uh, white antlers. Oh. I have some breakfast for you. It's called Flatjack number five. Ooh, somebody else is joining the third party. Dude, you better turn around. Oh, I'll turn around. Oh, I'll take that, thank you. <laughs> There's somebody behind him that threw that big mythic purple globy orby thing at him. And yet, oh, there he goes. Oh, he's determined. So is this, oh look, another purple glowy orb. He's right behind you, dude. I don't know, I guess there's three people. Okay, let me take care of this dude. There we go. Oh, wow, she's coming in hot. Wow, go. Getting quite the limbs here. All of a sudden it turned into a party, a slap party. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm glad I quadruple quintupled up on that. Well, actually quintuple, um, sixlets, sixlets, <laughs> there we go. They left me some good loot down here. He gave me the golden flapjack maker, man. That's sweet, oh, hey. We got some slurp and burp juice. I will take that. And I'll replenish the last three points. Gosh, she was loaded, man. If you look in my upper right hand corner of my screen, it looks like I got one of those sick llama heads. <laughs> It looks like a NyQuil llama head. This video is not sponsored. How about you looking at your Augs? It's not safe to look out Augs in the open. <laughs> oh, that dude's got the Aug with the Dragon Breast Sniper Rifle. Oh, he's burning down the house. Look, he's got a tree up there. Oh, he's shooting the other tree. Neener, neener, you can't see me. I'm in a bush and I'm at a low rise here. Or Got my back glove ready. Yeah, to get the DC Batman grappling hook, that would've been super sweet. Yeah, that's a sniper. Yeah, look, he's burning down the house, man. You can see it off to the left of me. That oh, looks like a bot, literally a bot. I think it's from, uh, what's that, uh, uh, what's that show? Knock Off of Simpsons, um, Futurama. Oh yeah, it's the bottom Futurama. He's, there he is. Oh man, I'm just a very, barely avoiding the storm too. Ooh, it's pretty hot around here. Six players left. Oh, there he is. Futurama dude's up there. He's got the dragon breast sniper rifle. What a sneaker, man. Ooh. Ooh, there's, oh. Okay, who wins, who wins, who wins? Okay, you go out. Oh, <laughs> oh, he dropped a crown too. <laughs> oh, somebody's purple globing it over here. Now three players left. Do I get the crown? Go ahead and put in the comments, do I get the crown? Um, Enery Mo. Oh, somebody else is coming. Go, 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 go. Get the crown. Yes. Okay, now we fire. Oh, he's widened, but he's too far away. Oh, hey, look. I got a nice little uh, drum shotgun. Legendary, it's time to go. Oh, didn't grab the next tree. Go, 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 go. Push, 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 push. Go ahead and pop it in case if anybody shoots at me. If they're not right on, I get to regenerate a little bit. I'm going back to my old stomping grounds. Hey, I blew that top of that house off. <laughs> yeah. I'm like it with Dana's, Santa's little helper, the reindeer horns. And I'm flying, delivering presents to all the good boys and girls. Look at all the Christmas trees here. Man, I tell you, there's a theme going on. And I like, oh, that was so cool. <laughs> you see her flip around. 
Oh, finally a place to, well, very place, uh, or just below where I blew up the roof. Ooh. Okay, 1v2. Oh. Ooh, you know what? That's another great Magic Mixie skin. I don't know if I have it, though. Blue? Somebody's up. They're both upstairs. Just running around like that. Somebody's going to run into somebody. Oh. Okay. 1v1. Oh, time to go. No, oh, he's whited. Yes! All right, guys, it's a dub, man. Another wish come true. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to like and subscribe. We've got more on the way. Please click on one of these videos for more events of fun.